Hey guys, Puggos Pizzeria here, back with another video, and you guys know what time it is. It is time for ranking your custom plushie 7. Now, just in case you guys don't know what this is, this is a series I do basically every 10 days on my channel where I ask you guys for your custom plushies, and I rank them in this video. Basically, it's your chance to be in a YouTube video. Uh, just before the video starts, uh, I do have basically a question for all you guys. And that is if you would like to see different things on my YouTube channel. Now, I know most of you guys are subscribed to my YouTube channel for Five Nights at Freddy's, but uh, I thought uh, I might want to change it up. Soon, I am planning on doing Roblox videos, but I do want to know if you guys want to see that. Uh, I am most likely going to make them like Flamingo's Roblox videos, just funny things, and I mess around in Roblox, uh, make fun of eight-year-olds on their mom's iPad. But, uh, so there is a poll up in the top right corner, and, uh, you can also leave a comment down below saying if you would like Roblox content, or if you wouldn't like it. Uh, I'm planning on starting off slow doing Roblox, like, maybe just, uh, like, one video every week or every two weeks, so it won't really interfere with the FNAF thing. Uh, trust, I won't stop doing Five Nights at Freddy's, but I just want to start doing Roblox. But, uh, without further ado, let's get right into ranking these custom plushies. So, the very first custom plushie, as you guys know, I, I basically have a favor towards these custom plushies. It is a Puggo custom plushie. But let me tell you, this Puggo custom plushie looks amazing. Now they took my new icon, which was kind of recently made, and they completely hand-sewn the entire thing with fill and everything, and I absolutely love how it looks. Um, I don't know, I just love Puggo custom plushies because, I mean, it's me, you guys spent your own time to make me as a custom plushie. I mean, that's kind of amazing. The next, uh, custom plushie we have is... Oh. Oh, God. Uh, that, we have... The... We, we have the Pillow Pet Fun Time Freddy. It's, it's, it's a pillow, it's a pet, it's a pillow pet. <laughs> the next one we have after that is Freddy Frostbear. Now, this Freddy Frostbear was obviously made using the, uh, Blacklight Freddy plushie, which does look really good. Uh, they added all the felt, basically did what I did, and it turned out very well. I, uh, really like the snowy scene that they put him in. Uh, I think that looks really cool. And this is a very nice Freddy Frostbear plushie. Uh, nice little, little chilly little Frostbear. The next one we have after that is Withered Bonnie. Now, the Withered Bonnie custom plushies. I know you guys send me tons of Withered Bonnie custom plushies, but I just really like this one. This one, I uh, can tell they did an amazing job making it with the whole head and how they cut it out. They had the end of all the teeth. I really like how they made this Withered Bonnie custom plushie. Uh, definitely one of the better ones that I've seen. And, uh, I don't know, I just liked them enough to put them in the video. The next one we have after that uh, is a Furnace Baby custom plushie. Now, I can tell after I said I really love the Furnace Baby in the last video, you guys made some more Furnace Babies, and this one is amazing. Now, Sadly, it's not as good as the previous one. That one, mwah, beautiful. But this one is still amazing. They did add the Fiery Inferno. I'm not sure if her chest can open up, but they added everything else, all the lines. They basically made the Funko version of Furnace Baby. The other one was a stylized version of Furnace Baby, but this one still looks amazing. The next one we have after that is another baby. This one is Scrap Baby. I also do get tons of Scrap Babies. Everyone makes them probably because of Five Nights at Froakies, but this one, again, looks really good. Everything that they added on the Scrap Baby, just, uh, I just like it. It's just a, overall a nice Scrap Baby. Nothing is wrong with it, and and, uh, everything looks really good on it. Next one we have after that is definitely a, a really weird one, I would say. We have Endo O2. Now this Endo O2, I, I'm honestly, it's kind of a creepy plushie. It's completely dead blank stare, just into nothingness, and how it, just everything that's made. Honestly, I really like this plushie. Yeah. I, I don't know, just everything they did on it, just how creepy he looks, how unsettling it is. It's a really nice custom plushie. Next one we have after that is Blora. Now, this is probably in favor of Blora being added to FNAF AR, but, uh, she looks so cool. It is completely hand-sewn. I mean, she, uh, something they might have sewn a little bit too much is her big old honka donk monkas, but still, very nice Blora plushie. Uh, I really, I really, I really like it. It looks exactly like Blora. The face has incredible detail. I can't believe, uh, how they fit that much detail with sewing and everything. It just looks really good. Uh, the next one we have, well, the next ones we have after that, this looks like every single FNAF AR custom plushie. Now, all the FNAF AR characters, they look, I mean, just really good together, all the different colors and styles that they have, and then the box that they have for the FNAF AR characters says FNAF AR on it, if you look close enough. This is really nice attention to detail, and I love everything they made for it. And the very final custom plushie we have 
is a glitch trap custom plushie. Now I know I uh, I do also get a lot of glitch traps, but this one looks really good. It looks like they did follow uh, the sort of Sly Pie style of his glitch trap that they made, and just everything that they made on him, his snout, his evil old stare, his evil old bunny stare, I think looks really good. But uh, yeah, that's it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to let me know if you guys do want to see Roblox content on, on this channel. But also, don't forget to subscribe. I am trying to get to 11k, just because that would be cool to hit 11k right after I hit 10k. You guys have been doing an amazing job since I asked this net yesterday. I got like 200 extra subscribers, so you guys are amazing. Keep subscribing. Uh, and trust me, guys. A lot of from yesterday's video, my pants were drenched with pee. So much pee everywhere. I was leave I was leaving a trail. It was everywhere. Yeah, so thank you guys. But yeah, that's it for today's video, and I will see you all later. Good.